to make sure you guys realize this because if you lease the program, you have the ability to fit some of these to the market that you're in. So we all know that I have a five sim and a three sim set up for you already on the templates that we sent out for you traders at least the program. There's three charts that we can trade off of, the five and the three. I have two deep retracement setups that come up. We can also use an additional three sim with the five sim settings with the parameters to catch shorter, shallow retracements in hard moving markets. And that was crude yesterday. It had some nice sells on crude yesterday because the market was in such a hard downtrend. So we know we got a five and a three to trade off of. But what happens is if you can go on the other spectrum of it and go larger time frame and hot markets, what does that mean? If you log in and let's say a fast moving market like the NASDAQ or the DAX is really moving hard up or hard down, you can actually look at a larger time frame going all the way up to a nine sim Rinko. Yeah, it's the five sim setting. Yep, you got it. So I can go all the way up to a, with the five sim setting, go to a nine sim. That's the largest I like to go on these markets. And you will get less setup. So if we're screaming up and these markets are moving pretty hard, you can, you can tell on, on your five and three sim templates if they were angled hard up. You can always have a long-term setup, a longer-term chart, I'm sorry, longer-term Rinko. A higher Rinko, meaning a nine Rinko, or the highest I go. And what that's going to allow you to see is it's going to allow you to see less retracements, but these trades are for longer position trade moves. And like I said, you'll get around two or three of these that produce a day. The difference is, is that like this morning, a shorter term chart, a shorter term rink, I'm sorry, this is what we've produced so far on a shorter term Rinko. We've had a trade here this morning on the NASDAQ futures, still a nice, nice size setup. But this one is a Resim going 30 days back. This is a deep retracement template we have set up for you. So you can have actually a real long term one on there if you're trading hot markets like my two favorites would be the NASDAQ futures and then also the DAX and so on. So we don't see them very often in slow moving markets <clears throat> on such a long time frame. On such a long Rinko, I'm sorry. We see them quite consistently on, let's say, the NASDAQ and some of these other markets that move quite well. All right, so make sure we understand that, is that these templates that we send out to you, you can actually change the SIM, the Rinko, right there. By going 30 days back, we go to 9, change to 6 if you want. You want less signals. What comes out into the program with you is the five and the three. That catches most of the swings. Okay. I just want to go over that because there's opportunities sometimes where there'll be days in hard markets where these are just uncanny. Catch some really big moves. Because it's looking at less retracements. All right, so just heads up on that. I want to make sure we understand. As always, what I'm using is I'm using the five sim Rinko settings for the nine sim and the five and the three sim Rinko settings for the uh, three sim for the shorter term retracements. Also, we have to understand that that I use those. So the standard two are obviously our five and our three. Our five and our three, that's the standard two that we use. 